the families are experiencing a substantially high stress level in shelter before COVID. Shelters housing homeless families are adjusting to the COVID-19 pandemic. The Friends Program in Concord houses eight families, including nine school-aged children. In a time of social distancing, they've moved some families into a hotel. It's a move a single mom with two kids is making while she tries to become self-sufficient. If it was not for the Friends, I honestly probably would have ended up in my car with my two children. They have made it so that myself and my two children, who are old enough to understand the situation, are not worrying about food or where we're going to sleep. Leanne Malasi curvison works for Family Promise of Greater Concord. They've stopped their practice of rotating families to different churches. Now they shelter one family and are concerned about those who just recently found housing. My, my worry is, is that the people that we have placed are going to eventually end up with issues um, in keeping those those places. Both shelters expect calls for their service to go up. We're going to have to improvise and come up with a plan, um, but still meet the needs of our families. We are looking to ensure that we are wrapping around the most vulnerable, vulnerable families that, that there are. And we're also looking ahead to a future where there are going to be more families who are um, experiencing homelessness or the threat of homelessness. And when the calls come, both shelters will keep adjusting to help. Jessica Moran, WMUR News 9.